Good morning, Central Wesleyan. My, you're looking great today. I'm Todd Johnson, the pastor of young adults and small groups, and I want to welcome you to Central Wesleyan Church. We are so excited that you've chosen to be here with us today. Now, there are just a few things that I want to highlight here for you, so buckle up because it's going to get intense. Now, first, I want to give you a virtual high five to all of you that are guests here at Central. Now, if you want to cash in and get a real high five or or just meet Pastor Paul, we have a sweet guest reception area for you to hang out. You can find it right by the big awesome windows near the coffee shop out those double doors. Now, if you picked up a bulletin this morning and you're just craving for more info on the happenings here at Central, which you can also pick up a weekly. Now, you're probably wondering, where are they? Well, don't break out the magnifying glass yet, Sherlock. You can grab them at the little info boxes located in the hallways around the worship center. News flash! The incredible team that brought us a 40 Days of Purpose series, they're bringing us a brand new one. It's called the 40 Days of Love, and it's gonna bring us to a whole new world of awesomeness through small groups, community groups, and Sunday morning services. And it's coming to you this fall. Seriously, guys, I am so excited about that because this is my area of ministry, and I'm so pumped to see our whole church unifying around one subject series, 40 Days of Love. It's gonna be great. So be ready to love like you have never loved before. Now, it smells like the worship team's up to something. Let's go check it out. Well, hello, <laughs> and welcome to the Worship Arts Planning Meeting. We're just sitting here with our pigs and blankets and our, <laughs> and our iPhones and Don't our yoga. And our pulp-filled orange juice. It's wonderful. But we are it's planning. Healthy. It is healthy. And we're planning the Worship Arts Celebration, formerly known as the Worship Arts Finale. But it's on June 6 at 6 p.m. And we really hope that you'll come. And it's going to be great on lots of different levels. For example. There is child care for ages four and under. And that's really good because I have a three-year-old. So yeah. I can come. And you have lipstick on your teeth. Aww. Right? <laughs> It'll be good. Okay. How, why else is good it going to be a great night? Friends. Oh, we have a variety of things happening and um, some surprises that we won't even tell people. We're working very hard, and the choir and orchestra have worked so hard, and the worship team and the instrumentalists, so fun, fun, fun. And some laughter also, which is always healthy. So that's good. Anything else? And we're going to have a little bit of cross-cultural enhancement, shall we say. <laughs> and we're not going to tell you anything more about that, but you're going to enjoy it a lot. So It's a great, play, great time to invite your neighbor. Yep, yeah. invite your neighbor, invite your friends. And if you're a first service person, second service person, a little something for everybody. So we sure hope you'll come. And Roger, you have any last words? Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>